Hey everybody, I wanted to show y'all that we got the gutter up right there on Saturday morning, first thing. We don't have the carpet down, that red carpet yet, but we've got all the cedar out, the cedar chips around the shrubs, and we also got the uh, crepe myrtle cut back out of the power lines. See? All up there. I don't know if you can see the power lines or not, but there they are, and they're the crepe myrtle. So we got them all cut back. All right, and Mr. Bucky had to go get a little more cedar, and he's got to go back and get yet more cedar for the back. So there it is. It smells like eastern red cedar out here. And we got a really heavy rain about three nights ago, and it packed it all down very nice. But we also got a lot of wind, and the river birch lost a lot of their leaves. Not a lot, but they shed. So anyway, we'll go back in and talk about what we're getting ready to do on the deck. Mr. Bucky filled a hole in there. A big pine tree used to be there. And we keep getting a hole there. So anyway, what we did on the, uh, to be able to get the gutter up, uh, I actually used my, cough, my uh, desk is 36 inches high and the porch is 36 inches high. So we put it right down here, put the big tall step ladder on it and I was able to reach it with no problem with Mr. Bucky holding everything, of course. And we did check it with water and uh, this side runs out and hits in this shrubbery here and this one hits in this shrubbery. All right, we'll be back. Okay, hi, for y'all who are new, I'm Phyllis from southernfrugal.com. Um, it's early and uh, the sun isn't quite up yet, but it's getting ready to pop out and we'll see some bright sunshine probably all day today. There's not a cloud in the sky anywhere today. But anyway, uh, so we got the uh, stain and water sealer down on the deck. And I've got a rug to go down here. It's not a big one. I think it's like five by eight. These are the Adirondack chairs, which I love. They are super comfortable. Got these at Lowe's for $19.98 each. Really a good deal, y'all. All right, so let me show you around now. We, of course, got the grill over here and we've Mr. Bucky's already cut the little uh, section out that we're going to put here. I think I told y'all the story about that already. Uh, and he started to dig up the post that this uh, clothesline is in because we're definitely taking that with us to Mountain Rest. And he realized that he put it all in cement. There was a little glove that went on it but then he somehow didn't use that, and so we still got to dig the whole thing up. It's because it's in cement. But anyway, here's the deck, and I finished the rails late one night, and we're gonna put the indoor-outdoor, well, it's not indoor carpet, it's totally outdoor carpet on these steps in a tan color. I've already got that and got the glue and everything. And of course, the flowers are just waiting to go down. But I did clean these stepping stones, which was really, really good. And I can't think of anything else. I do want to go ahead and post so y'all would not think I dropped off the pace of the earth. I haven't. We've been working. And uh, we, uh, the last video I did, I did the, uh, showed you how we did the little things around our neck. Well, we've progressed from that to uh, a little... Um, towel thing that I got at Walmart. They're almost like the baby diapers from bygone years where it was this big square thing. They're very absorbent. And these are like uh, towels. They're selling them as towels for the kitchen. And they are made in Pakistan and you get four for, I don't know, four or five dollars. Anyway, we are using those because they're big and you can actually tie them around your neck and put more ice cubes in them. Maybe I'll show you that in a little while. Uh, Mr. Bucky's in there, his chore in the morning is putting, unloading the dishwasher, so 
he's in there doing that and fixing his coffee and we're going to go in and um, fix a smoothie we're not going to fix it from scratch because i've got some frozen so that's what we're going to do anyway uh yeah we were out here cutting the crepe myrtle back on saturday and it was a hundred degrees y'all and uh what we uh, have been doing we can come out and work about 20 minutes and that's how long it takes the ice cubes that we put in that little tie around thing for our neck and in 20 minutes it's all melted we come in take a break get more ice go back out it, it, it works really really well because i can think in times past when the temperature was so high like i'm oh, sorry so high like that that uh you couldn't work out more than about 10 minutes. I got too much sun on my face and my arms and my arms are all scratched up from the crepe myrtle and the shrubbery uh, from doing that last week. Anyway, we're gonna, I'm gonna try my best to get this carpet glued down uh, this morning. And I've also got to finish washing this uh, siding here. Uh, you probably it doesn't show up on the camera in fact on the camera it looks perfectly clean but it's not it's dirt over in here all up in there and i'll just simply get up on the ladder and use my extension mop and i can get it clean that way so yeah my plants have all made it through the this heat wave which has been going on i don't know for over a week now but anyway, it took me a long time to do those spindles on the on the uh, rail there, but I thought they looked pretty darn good. Anyway, this is a gold color because I couldn't find any other color at our Lowe's. They just had the clear Thompson's water sealer and that that was uh, tinted with what they called honey gold. So that's what we used. But anyway, it all worked out and. Uh, so let's see if there's anything else. Can y'all see the two doves that are sitting up on the line there? Let's see where they are. Yeah, right. Well, they're not showing up. Let's see if we can zoom up there and see. They're there. They're uh, morning doves. There they are. There they are. Yeah. They're sort of like pigeons, and they're mourning, to, yeah, not mourning like mourning, but M-O-U-R-N-I-N-G, doves. I can't hold this still enough, let's see, there. There they are, they're always together. All right, let's come back. Oop. Come back, there we are. Yeah, so these two doves have, have been up there. In fact, I don't know if it's the same ones, but we have two every year that come. They make a nest somewhere in the yard. I don't know where. Probably not in the backyard because the dog would get the babies if they did. But anyway, they're there every year. And uh, every year they come back. And uh, I think it's probably the same two. I don't know. They probably mate for life. Anyway, I can't think of anything else, y'all. We're going in to uh, have the uh, smoothie from the ice cube, you know, from the ice cube tray where I froze it from uh, a couple of days ago and a couple of days before that. And uh, anyway, I got really rested, y'all. My eyes are all puffy this morning. I think I slept 10 hours Saturday night. And if that wasn't enough, I took a nap yesterday afternoon and so did Mr. Bucky. So we're all rested and ready to go this morning and see how much we can get done before the heat of the day happens. All right, so we will see y'all next time. If we get the, the deck finished, the carpet glued down and that, I'll record that today. If not, we'll see you another time. All right, bye. And there's Steely. Look at him, he's standing there waiting to sit, to come out. He doesn't like it when I come out and he doesn't get to come. I don't know where Peppy is, probably in there where the food is. There he is, there's Peppy. There's Peppy, come here, say hello. Hey Peppy. <laughs> can y'all see him? Yeah, you can see him. There they go, food time. All right, bye.